So just like the exponential graph, we should be able to do transformations to this log graph that we've learned now as well. So hidden in this equation, in this function, is the basic log graph, which is y equals log base 2 of x. Log base 2 of x. So let's put these points on here really quickly. x is 2, y is 1, when x is 1, 2, 3, 4, y is 2. So I'm going to be working with these three points and the asymptote, which is the y-axis. So the first thing we've got is a vertical expansion by a factor of 3. So we've got to draw y equals 3 log base 2 of x. So I need to triple all my y values. Well, if I triple 0, Tripling 0 is still 0, tripling 1 is 3, and tripling 2 is 2, 4, 6. Just got to remember this is a y value of 6, but it's off by scale. And finally, I think we can do these last two transformations in one step. We vertically expanded by a factor of 3. Now we're going to move it left 1 and down 2. So if I take my asymptote and move it left 1 and down 2, my asymptote will be right here. Moving it left 1, we'll move it over here. Moving it down 2 is not going to have any effect on it. But let's do that to our three key points. So move it left 1 and down 2. Point right there. Move it left Move it left 1 and down 2, puts it right here. And our point here, which was 4, 6. Move it left 1 is at 3, move it down 2 is at 4. So I've taken my three key points on my green graph, and I moved them all left 1 and down 2, and I've got my asymptote. So the graph come along the asymptote, kind of hit that point, hit that point, and hit that point, and gradually curve to the right. So that red graph would represent a sketch of the function y equals 3 log base 2 of x plus 1 minus 2.